This tutorial demonstrates how to use Loopy from AUM without leaving AUM. The audio bus palette is the key. It provides controls for all the apps loaded into your audio bus session. It lets you control Loopy playback and recording without leaving AUM or whatever host you are using. When you are in audio bus, tap an apps icon to switch to it. The audio bus palette appears in any app that is part of the session. The palette has controls for each audio bus app. Tapping an app's icon hides or shows the app's controls. This is the app switch icon. Tap on it to switch to another app. Loopy provides audio bus controls for the functions you need for a recording session. This tutorial covers Loopy's default behavior. The loops are synchronized and loop lengths are multiples of a basic loop cycle. Loopy can also be set up for unsynchronized and unquantized recording. The play icon is active when Loopy has something to play. If there is nothing to play, it is grayed out. If you don't manually set a tempo or sync to a clock, the first loop recorded in your session determines the base loop length. Tap to start recording immediately. Tap again to end the loop and start playing. Tapping again arms recording. Recording starts when the cycle indicator reaches the top and continues till the loop cycle is over. The loop multiple sets how many loop cycles will be recorded. Tap it to cycle through multiples up to 32. You can also set a session's tempo before starting. The tempo sets the base loop length. Tap tempo and metronome are also available. Loopy can be synced to other apps with Ableton Link, MIDI Clock, or IAA Sync. Thanks for watching.